Hi, my name is Mark Duncan. I'm sales director here at NetDocuments, and today I'm going to give you a quick preview of our new 17.2 user experience. is the result of a year's worth of design based on user feedback, analytics, user sessions. All of that has been taken into account as we completely redesign the user experience in NetDocuments. As we look at the 17.2 interface, we're going to go from left to right. As I mentioned before, the entire experience has been designed around getting a user to their most recent or their most important content. As we look in NetDocuments here, we still have the navigation pane which can be expanded by simply clicking that option there in the upper left. This navigation pane can open or collapse at will, or if users continually want to see this, they're welcome to pin that navigation pane as well. In addition, NetDocuments understands that the two most important parts of any document management system are the documents and the matter-centric workspaces. So front and center in the left-hand side is a box for each of those, and that is unique to each user. So as a user, when I log into NetDocuments, the first thing I see are my most recent and favorite documents and my most recent and favorite matters. In addition, NetDocuments has kept the consistent, simple search box up here at the top of the page. And as always, this search box will continually follow the user around, regardless of which page they are located on in NetDocuments. NetDocuments has also added a Go to Matter button. There are numerous cases where a user needs to get to a matter, but it's not in their recents, and it's certainly not one of their favorites. This button allows the user to type anything they may know about a particular client matter to quickly get access. That includes the name, the number, or they may just know a simple word that perhaps is in the description of the matter. In my case, I'm gonna type in the word bank, and NetDocuments will dynamically show me any matters in the firm that contain the word bank. Now, Documents has also completely redesigned the list view as well. So, for example, if I click Recent Documents, we'll see a list view in Net Documents. Over here, you still have the consistent checkboxes, and once those are selected in Net Documents, we dynamically pop open both a preview pane and a details pane. Preview, of course, gives you a web preview of the document. Details shows you all of the information about that document, including versions, link documents, locations within the system, etc. Now, Documents has shifted the options for each document to be here in the upper right hand side of the screen. Users can choose which options they want to appear up here in the upper right. And if they want to see all options, they simply click the More button, and Net Documents will show them all of the options available for that particular document. The 17.2 user experience change also translates into the matter-centric view as well. When a matter-centric workspace is selected in NetDocuments, you'll see that we have a new dynamic view for these matter-centric workspaces. As always, users can see a summary view where we high-level pull together all of the documents and emails for a particular matter, or they can choose list view where we show them top to bottom the most recent documents and emails added for any particular matter. Now, Documents has also changed the simple search box so that it dynamically follows the user on every page of the system. For example, if I'm looking at a particular matter, the scope of this simple search box is narrowed to just that particular matter. As I continue to move around the matter-centric workspace, you'll notice that the scope of that search box dynamically changes as well. For example, if I were to choose agreements, you'll notice that search box at the top of the screen has now narrowed the scope of my search to just agreements for just this particular map. Thank you for your time today. From all of us here at NetDocuments, we appreciate your interest and we look forward to providing you a world-class document and email management solution in the cloud.